Chapter 51 to Mary White, Battle Creek, Michigan, October 29, 1889. Dear Daughter Mary, I have sent in this some seersucker plaid, thinking it would be good and strong for aprons. I send you that thick woolen goods to use as you may think best. I have knit a pair of wristers for Ella. We'll knit a pair for Mabel if I can and send soon. I think you will need a mattress, cotton top mattress, which I will send by Brother Gates. I told Reba to be sure and write to me just what you needed in quilts or in bedding mattresses. I have received no line from her. Perhaps she forgot it, but let me know about it if you can as soon as possible. We are having a good meeting. There seems to be no dissension. The testimonies which have been borne by ministers are that the light that came to them at Minneapolis and during the past year has been highly appreciated, and they will walk in the light. They have seen more of the blessedness of the truth and the love of Jesus than ever before in their lives. That success has attended their labors during the past year as never before, and they enjoyed the presence and the love of God in large measure. This has been the testimony born, and the meetings are excellent. At the same time, there are a number who apparently stand where they did at Minneapolis. Oh, that God would work mightily for his people, and scatter the clouds of darkness, and let the sunlight of his glory in. I am much pleased with the meeting. Thus far, not one voice of opposition is heard. Unity seems to prevail. I have had precious seasons of prayer in your behalf, and I believe the Lord is working for you, and Satan will be disappointed. Willie was very much tired when he got here. His head would not work, but I have talked pretty plainly to him with some authority. And dear Mary, Jesus is your helper. Do not doubt this for one moment. Just look up and believe and trust in God, the living God. I see no reason why the Lord has not heard our prayers. I believe with all my heart and mind that he has done this. Just trust in the Lord fully and do not be discouraged. Hope in God. Praise his holy name. He loves you and has a fatherly care for you. Oh, that God will be your helper every day. I think much anything I can get for you, I will do so. Mother